Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red. And just a heads up so you don't think I was lazy these past couple of days. I have made some a, a big change to my team and that is that I have added one Pokemon off screen. You're about to find out which one and just to explain why I did it off screen is because I needed to travel a long way well, back at the beginning basically around Pewter City to get this one I researched online where I could get it and it's the Pokemon that a friend of mine suggested to me actually he requested that I catch him and here he is it is a Nidoran let's take a look at him he has relaxed nature he's a poison type a male uh, and uh, I called him Bruce so yes poison point poisons poisons fall on contact which I think is gonna be very awesome and yeah this is gonna be our newest team member he's a level 6 I caught him with an ultra ball I'm saying all this just so you wouldn't you know be uninformed so yes this is our newest team member and I cannot wait to begin training him and see what happens anyway let us continue on our journey now I found out that um, I found out where I need to go I think I found out I roamed around a little bit um, and we're gonna go down here yes let's cut this tree down buzzer I like you and let's go up here now this I believe is where I need to go because it is the place that I have not yet um, been to so let's research I mean research explore here and I have my first trainer bell on this route so let's go for it um, alrighty oh now I'm gonna train my Nidoran the same way I I trained um, the other guys when they were a small level I'm just gonna you know put them out and then I'm gonna switch I'm gonna switch out to someone more powerful in this case I'm gonna go for my Ferona because she is the lowest level here and I believe she should be super effective against this Oddish oh god it's peril paralysis again isn't it okay okay I can work around that I think I'm gonna be good Let's use Gust. Okay, this should decrease my evasiveness. Um, go for it, Verona. Yes, I think this should one-shot him because I'm super effective. Yep, I'm right. Um, Adish is down. And Brute already grew one level. That is, that is really awesome. And he grew two levels. That's a, a massive experience boost for him. He wants to learn Focus Energy. Uh, um, yeah, he learned it because he only has two moves. I forgot to, I forgot to show you that. Now I'm gonna go switch out to Bruce again, and I'm gonna switch right back to Ferona in the next round. Oh, he looks kind of awesome. I, I might add. I think um, I did not look up it, uh, but I think I know which Pokemon this guy um, evolves into. I'm pretty sure based on the, on what he looks like. Let's gust this one again. Growth. What does that do? I cannot remember. Special attack. Okay. Um, yeah, that's it for you, Bellsprout. I'm very sorry. A critical hit there. And... Brute <laughs> grew another level. That's great. Uh, Oddish. Yeah, let's just keep keep on to it. Training our Brute. I'm gonna be training him off screen. As well just so he would catch up I'm not gonna evolve him off screen though because that just a, I mean I already caught him off screen so it would be just a cheap shot to evolve him off screen as well uh, although I'm not sure what level he actually evolves at so we'll see I guess I shouldn't really overtrain him or anything like that yeah gust him one shotting everyone Corona's a beast against these plant guys let's level up again come on Bruce yep there we go and Verona a little bit more Bellsprout again yeah this might be a little a little bit boring I'm just switching out but hey I want my brute to be powerful like the rest of the guys on my team I mean they're not that powerful they probably should be a lot more powerful at this point in the game I'm not really sure should I be training them more or anything We'll just have to see about that one, I'm afraid. And now let's Gust again. Yeah, this paralysis really isn't working for him, is it? I mean, it has not kicked in once. Oh, 
Okay, do you grow again? Yeah, you do level 11 for you, Bruce. And Ferona should level up as well. Yep, 24. That's way to go with Ferona. Um, yeah, that's it for this one. She had a lot of Pokemon, actually. Was it 5 or 4 or something like that? Let's keep going. Let's not waste any time. I see a Pokeball here. TMO 40 Aerial Ace. Now, that sounds very interesting, I might add. Um, Aerial Ace. Where am I? A TM Case, right. I forgot. That do not play this game for two days and I forget everything. Um, Aerial Ace. Aerial Ace. There we go. An extremely fast deck against one target that can be evaded. Yeah, I think I'm gonna be teaching my. If I guess my Ferona could learn it. I'm gonna be teaching Ferona this move. Now, let's see. Her. It, sorry, not. No! I misclicked. I actually forgot Sand Attack. Damn it. I wanted to. Okay, never mind. I never use Sand Attack anyways. What am I saying? I mean, I wanted to forget Gust if this one is better, but okay, I guess. I did not lose that much. Let's fight against this guy next. Oh, great. I was bored. Yeah, me too. Uh, let's go for it, guys. This is a hiker, Jeremy, and he has two Pokemon. Machop. Okay, my Ferona should eat that Machop right up. As soon as I do not press back, but poke freaking man. Go for Rona. Yeah. I think Brute's gonna be a very nice addition to the team once he once he's up the level of the rest of the guys. By the way, I uh, had to go through let's try this aerial ace thing. Oh come on, now you kicking? Now? Um I wanted I um, had to go uh, through this place called Oh my god, I do a lot of damage. Through this place called um, the Diglett Cave to get back to... To get back to Route 3. And... Oh, I learned Double Kick, that's nice. And that's a really good place to train my buzzer, I might add. Because it's just, it's just a, a, a tunnel with filled up, full of Diglett. If there's not anything important there, so I don't, didn't feel the, the need to show it out on screen. Um... And those guys really cannot stand up to to my uh, to my buzzer, my beadroom. It basically one shot. At, what was it? Um, I think I have to send out Grackle. Um, my buzzer one shot at all of them. I mean, with the with the Twindle ability. Water pulse, go for him, Grackle. You cannot take this, Onyx. I still don't get how a rock type is weak to a water type. If I knew, if I didn't know any better, I think it was the other way around. To be honest. Yeah, that's it for hiker Jeremy. Jeremy, Jerry, you. And let's go. Let's just keep exploring. Let's fight this guy. It looks like a bug catcher to me. Yeah, I imagine something about cocoons. So I guess he has a cocoon on his team. And a Metapod. He has a Beedrill. That's nice. Okay, let's see whose Beedrill is the Alpha Beedrill around here. Is it my Buzzer or your Beedrill? Beedrill. Um, yeah, Alpha Male. Let's pick the Alpha Male here. Okay, pecking me. Uh, that's not Peck. That's a Fury Attack, I believe. Yes. And I'm gonna go for, go for Twindle. Let's see how much damage this does. That's very nice, but it was a crit. I guess this is not very effective against this one. Yeah, we called it. Um, still did pretty nice damage. And I'm gonna just go for a cut now. Hope this one shot it. Yes, it did. Yeah, cut's a pretty nice ability. Brood grew up again. And Buzzer got some experience. Beedrill again. Let's go for Brood. I hope the friend I mentioned earlier really appreciates what I had to go through to get this booth. I hope he's gonna be good, I really do. Let's go for Buzzer again, because Beedrill on Beedrill is just a fair fight, although my Beedrill is 6 levels higher than yours, but hey, we can overlook that, right? It's not that big of a difference. Okay, really, why don't I not... never mind. I'm gonna go for a cut, it seemed to do a lot of damage. Yeah, that's nice. More than a half, so two cuts should suffice. There we go. 
Oh, my brute is really on fire around here. He grew, he was level 4, now he, 6, now he's level 14. He grew, he grew 4 levels in 3 fights. That's pretty nice. What Pokemon can I find around here? Although I'm not really looking to add any new two, two team members right now. Okay, I'm guess I'm gonna have to see. Oh, it's a Sparrow. No, never mind. Um, I'm not looking to add any new team members at the moment. Why can't I? Oh my god, he's gonna kill me right now, isn't he? Ah, you got poison. That's the poison point for you. Oh, I hope I survive this. I really do. Okay, only two times. Okay, I can, I can deal with that. Pokemon, let's send out Buzzer. And I'm just gonna run away. I don't even see the point in killing this. Okay, I'm just gonna kill him. Who cares? Dwindle is gonna take care of it for me. Um, I, I have a low level Pokemon, so I think I should train him up to a respectable level and then look for other team members, to be honest. Okay, that's it for you. You, you did a lot of trouble. You're just you're a troublemaker. Yeah, at least Brute got some more experience. Um, now let's see if I can fight this guy. Yeah, I can. Yeah, I can. Um, hiker, probably. Camper, no. Camper, Chris. Growlithe, that's a... Uh, wow, that thing is cool. I want one. Where do I get the Growlithe, guys? And wow. That, 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 I know that Pokemon, I think. Um, and it's quite awesome. I like it. I like it very much. And I'm gonna be look looking for this one. I can feel it right now. I'm gonna be looking for this one as soon as I find out where to find one. Let's go for a water pulse. He should not be able to suffice one. Uh, there we go. That's all I wanted to see. Brute grew up again. Brute is on fire. Charman. Oh, I should have. I should have switched out. Never mind. Charmander. Yeah. Charmander. You're not gonna do anything to me. Although I like the the, the fire team you got going there, Captain Chris. I really do. I really should have switched out to to Groot. Maybe he would have got some nice experience out of it. Um, down here there is. I don't know what the, there is down here. To be honest, I'm gonna go check. Fuck you, I'm gonna fight you right now. Fight me. Battle me. Duel me. However you say. Okay. Geodude. Well, against the Geodude, I have a Graco. Graco is my man for these guys. No, seriously. If I did not have Graco on this team, I do not know what I would do against Rock Tapes. Actually, if I did not have Graco, I would not probably get past the first gym that easy. I don't know if I made just a good choice there, but I, I was told that it doesn't really matter which one you pick because they're all equally good, except at different points in the game, I think. I don't know if I picked the Charmander, which would have definitely been my second choice. How would I be able to defeat um, Brock because he is... I think the Charmander would be very weak against Rock types, right? Against Onyx. I think Onyx will absolutely pulverize him. So I don't really know. I do not know. Let's go, Mag not the Mega Punch. Oh God, I screwed up there. It's not effective. <laughs> yeah, I bet it's not effective. Okay, he at least wasted his turn, so it's not gonna be that big of a game changer. Water Pulse should still take care of that, and it did definitely did so let us continue on brute grew up again wow with this rate brute is gonna evolve in this very episode if i just can continue sorry if i can just continue oh my freaking god i call i definitely called it i cannot believe this is actually happening i mean i said it and okay guys i don't know what you're thinking but i did not know that he was gonna evolve right now <laughs> oh this is amazing brute is evolving Okay, he's just a slightly bigger purple rabbit, but still looks very awesome. Nidorino! Okay, Nidorino, welcome to the team. Let's pick this up and burn heal. That might come in handy. Um, if there is like a fire type gym next, I don't know. Let's take a look at the Nidorino. Relaxed nature, method round 3, okay, we know about that. So it's all the same except the picture is a little bit different. 
Here's his moveset. Leer, Peck, Focus Energy, and Double Kick. The last two we learned in this episode, the first two he came with. I don't know how he's able to do a flying type ability, to be honest. But I'm not judging, I'm not judging. Anyway, he is still a poison type. I know that some of the guys change their type as they evolve. Um, attack, defense, okay. I think it looks like his attack is stronger than his special attack. That's always good to know. Okay, well, I think um, we're just gonna go continue on this path. Um, yeah, this is where I'm supposed to go. And let's fight this bug catcher guy. I can now recognize by this by their sprites what they're called and what cast they belong in. Caterpie. Um, it's level 20 Caterpie. I'm gonna try taking that with the... Oh, he looks so cool. Um, I'm gonna try taking him out here and now. Okay, that does pathetic damage. Sorry, Brute, but it's not very effective. Um, yeah, he's gonna lower my speed. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to take him out with, um, with Boo. Let's try with Peck. That should be super effective, actually. No, it shouldn't. Or it should it. I don't know. Yeah, it's definitely super effective. So I'm able to take these guys out with uh, Bruce alone because he grew 10 levels in this episode. Oh, come on. That's just a cheap shot. Can you get poisoned, Caterpie? Don't think about that. Okay, um, yeah, get some experience on your own, Brute. Venonat. Uh, I'm gonna change. But first, I should probably let the bell start so my Brute would get some experience out of it. And I am gonna change to Buzzer. I'm gonna try taking this one out with Buzzer. By using Cut, I think, would be the best way to go and keep it. I thought I was gonna put him to sleep, that actually confused me. Let's try using cut and hope I do not hurt myself. And I did not! That's nice. Oh, cut did much less damage than I hoped it would do. I might as well try with fury attack. I might get lucky and get some crits off. And I hurt myself, of course I did. This would be awesome if I hurt myself like five times. Oh god, I might have to switch around here. I still okay. I'm not confused anymore. Let's go for this attack. I, ooh, wow, this is just I, I don't even know what to say. I'm done, barely alive, guys. Um, I did not want to click run. I want to go to Graco. Graco seems to be the only healthy one at the moment. So yeah, I guess Graco is gonna be taking care of this battle. And by the next one, I'm gonna have to heal up a little bit. Oh, come on! Okay, at least he didn't. Rapid spin, let's try that out. Okay, that's nice. I, I do not really know what kind of damage that does. Maybe it's better than bite, I don't know. Weedle! Yeah, let's change that out to Brute first, and then, and then we'll see. Weedle, let's go for Draco again because the, the other guys are just very very low on health. So Draco, until we reach the Pokemon Center, probably you're gonna be you're gonna have to tank this thing out, bro. You really will. Or maybe I have a couple of potions lying around just to heal up, like for Rona or rather. Um, okay. <laughs> Yeah, my brute's pretty awesome, I know. I like him. Okay, I should have probably healed up before I ran into that guy. To be honest, I did not really know there was gonna be a guy there, but never mind. My Graco can take care of his four freaking Pokemon. Uh, I'm... Hmm, double kick? Uh, Rotata is a normal and uh, double kick's a fighting type move, so it should be super effective, and it is, I'm right. You could have taken him out, you know. You really could. Let's go for a peck. Oh, please survive. Oh, God, he got, he got poisoned. Yeah, my brute is really not ready to take care of himself just yet. He, he's level 17, I mean. The other guy's out leveling. The opponent's in. Sanshu. Yeah, I know who I'm gonna send out against us. Sanshu, my super effective Graco man. 
Oh god, he still has three Pokemon to go. How long is this gonna take? Probably not that much if I just keep Grackle out. Let's just keep taking care of them. Shouldn't take too hard. I'm not even gonna change anymore. Because I'm... I don't... He has five Pokemon. I cannot change for every one of them. Same true. Yeah, yeah. Just keep at it. I can one-shot all of them. They are not whatever you want. Second Sentry down. And the third one is gonna be another Rotata, maybe. I don't know. Let's see. Ekans. Okay. Against an Ekans, I'm gonna use... Um, I'm gonna use... I don't know what I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use Rapid Spin just to see how much damage it can do. That's pathetic. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna try with a Bite. Let's see which one does better. Yeah, Bite definitely does better. I think when I when I get to a choice which ability I need to to erase, I'm gonna have to erase Rapid Spin. Bite is just better, apparently. Okay, that takes care of that one. We are really are earning nice amounts of money, to be honest. Um, let's see, I can only go up, so let's go up, and I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna do the smart thing here. I'm gonna heal one of my Pokemon um, because I do not want. Where is it? Super potion. There we go. I do not want any of my guys, uh, mainly Graco, to be an experienced hug, as I said. So I'm gonna. Sorry, uh, so I'm gonna try using Ferona for a change a little bit because she is still my well, not my lowest level. Brute is my lowest level, but I mean of the other three guys, she's the lowest. And I did not think this through actually because I cannot use Ferona against hikers because hikers have Rock type Pokemon. I'm just gonna have to stick to Grapple for this battle as well. But I, I'll be sure to use Ferona for the next battle. Even though she's paralyzed, she can still take care of herself. Magnitude. Um, Diglett used this against me. And it was a very, very effective move. Okay, that's one, one of them down. Yeah, I cannot afford to mess with these guys if they're gonna use Magnitude against me. I'm just gonna have to one chat on Grakko. Do not have much choice in the matter, I'm afraid. Water Pulse again. That takes care of him. And the last one is probably another Giri or something. Or an Onyx. Or something like that. Machop. Okay, I yeah, Machop was one of the options. Um, yeah, bite him. There you go. A critical hit. Okay, so I'm not biting him again. I'm gonna use... I'm gonna use a Water Pulse. That should take care of him, I guess. Yep. So, yeah, this water pulse ability is very, very powerful, I must say. What's this? Um. Yeah, this is the last battle on Route 9, so let's go for it. Don't you dare pat patronize me. I'm not patronizing you, little girl. Well, not a little girl, I mean, you're probably around my age. Um, now I'll move level 23 Meowth, actually, that's... I don't know how powerful a Meowth is, but level 23, really? I'm gonna go set out my Ferona, I do not want to heal, to have healed her for nothing. Scratch. Wow, it's pretty. Let's go for the Aerial Ace. And I hope I do not get paralyzed, uh, or I didn't. Okay, quick attack, I should take care of this. There you go. Yeah. No matter how higher level your Pokemon is, one Pokemon just won't cut it against me or against anyone else, I guess. Okay. A new place, a new route. Let's see. What is there around here? Um, okie dokie. Seems to be... A Pokemon say let's go heal up for a sec and then I'm gonna see what can I find around here heal up my Pokemon nice and easy thank you so now 
And now what do I do? Is this guy gonna fight me? Probably. You always lose in a Pokemon gym. Let's see why. Let's see how good you are if you're always using a freaking Pokemon gym. Pikachu. Um, let's change out to Buzzer because Buzzer is a menace against electric types as we've seen in the last episode. Double's gonna double team, okay. Evasiveness. Um, Windle him. There you go. That should be taking care of that. And alright. That's it. Root, buzzer. Clefairy. Mm, I'm gonna send out for Ron against the Clefairy. Just because it's a female and it will not fall in love with it. Let's go for a freaking aerial ace. Appears to be better than um, than Gust. Yeah, it's a pretty nice ability. I don't think I'm gonna be forgetting that anytime soon. Okay, so now we have made it to a cave apparently of some sort. Let's see what this says. Dark tunnel. Detour to Lavender Town. Oh my god, it is dark in here. So yeah, guys, you've seen what we're gonna be doing in the next episode. And for now, goodbye.